In part two, it's all about the number 11. For anyone new, 11 is Janice's number and it represents his door. I mean, you just look at this. Bill Gates <laughs> is named after Janice. Crazy. So this first section is just a little bit on Bill Gates. Bill Gates got married in January, Janice's month. But look closely. He got married on the first day of the first month, which is, yep, an 11. Bill Gates in Gematria equates to 11. <laughs> it's crazy. Even Melinda is an 11. Melinda Gates, there you can go, 11. But wait, she's known as Melinda French Gates now. I've got you covered. 164 equals 11. Some people say, Paul, the clones. Again, 11. Windows 11 got announced to the world on the 11th, on June the 24th, 2021. And it's Windows 11. No coincidence there. Let's go to the building, the Microsoft headquarters. It's building 92. You got it. 11. <laughs> but listen to this. There's no secret I worked really hard on my idea to get as good as I could. And then knocks on door after door out of 1,200 people. 11 said yes. Those 11 made me a millionaire. 11? And guess what? He has 11 rules. <laughs> you can't make this shit up, as I say. But guess what? He was born on October the 28th, 1955. As you know, October means 8. So add the date, add 2, add 8, add 1, add 9, add 5, add 5. You got it comes to 3811 from the beginning I've been showing you COVID is a ritual to Janos I mean just look at it the word coronavirus has 11 letters in simple geometry coronavirus adds to 155 which is 11 face mask 146 adds to 11. Mutated virus that we hear a lot. 173 adds to 11. When is a coincidence? Not a coincidence, guys. COVID-19 is 11. Remember, they changed the name to SARS-CoV-2 on the 11th of February. <laughs> 11. But guess what? In Gematria, SARS-CoV-2 adds to 155 is 11. Guys, it's all for 11. So, this pandemic ritual, all to Janos. His month is January. And look, the first known death associated with this happened on the 11th. What are the odds on that, guys? All these 11s that you've seen and will see. It is just crazy. So to finish off this section, I just wanted to show you, remember the Lambda variant. Well, Lambda in Greek alphabet is the number 11. So that's why I had to show it. Plus, if you look at the, the symbol for it, it looks like a stylized A. Well, if you're into sci-fi or remember the, the TV series Stargate, it's the same symbol. Isn't it a coincidence that Stargate is about gates, travel, and we have a god called Janos, who is a god of doorways and portals. <laughs> Just a coincidence. Now, this is from The Who. The Lambda variant is one of 11 official SARS-CoV-2 variants recognised by them, the World Health Organisation. It was first detected in Peru and has spread to 29 countries. Two and nine? Eleven. Oh, come on, guys. <laughs> That's just a coincidence, they say. Now, we also have the Mu variant. Well, if you remember my video on Lemuria where I first showed you the Festival of the Dead, it comes on 9, 11 and 13 and it'll appear in a minute when I'm just recapping on the 9-11 video. Again, 11. All these 11s is them showing you a ritual to Janus paying homage to their god who goes by so many names. I believe there were no planes on 9-11 but why but why did they say there were 
because and this is the big reason 9-11 was a ritual a ritual to Janos a ritual to his number the number 11 9 11 9 add 1 add 1 equals you got it 11 the twin towers as you can see 11 the number 11 represents a door a portal and a transition even Freemasonry have it as an ancient symbol. And I've talked about this in the last few weeks, as you know. That symbol shows the patron saints of Freemasonry. Saint John the Baptist and Saint John the Evangelist. John is a derivative of Yamos. The Twin Towers stood 110 stories high. Wait, 110, isn't that 11? 1 add 1 equals 11. In antiquity, leaders and gods lived in the north. So you would look up to them symbolically. What plane did they say hit the north tower? It was American Airlines Flight 11. The flight had 11 crew. A pilot was called John Ogonavsky. So John again. They say 92 were killed. Again, 11. 92, 9 2 equals 11. American Airlines equals AA, A equals 1, so 2 AAs equals 11. New York is the 11th state. This is one of the most iconic images that we have always seen of New York. Do me a favour. Count the number of workers. I count 11. And there you go guys, there's a little section on New York. Remember in the first Janice Rituals video, Janice is the sun and the solstice. So if you've not seen it, check it out. He is also known as Janua Inferni and Janua Coli. That's the name given. Or also known as the Heaven's Gates. According to those who worship him, the sun cycle takes, yep, you got it, 11 years. In other videos, I've shown you Apollo, the god of the sun, is Janos. Well, Apollo is associated with the number 11. And it's just a quick image to show you that I'm not going crazy. He's associated with number 
in 11. Now, obviously, Janos is known as, you know, the sun and the moon. And in alchemy, we have gold and silver representing the sun and the moon. Well, look in Gematria. AU, AG, adds to 209, which is 11. <laughs> Crazy. Now, we also got one of the earliest names that I've found for Janos, the entity behind it, and he's known as IA, the first god of Sumeria. And as you can see, the example these have given even included 11 names, which is obviously just a coincidence, or is it? But IA is, yep, you got it, in Greek numeral, it is number 11. Just wow. <laughs> it is, it just really gets you, like, the significance of this number 11. So do you remember in my old video, the circuit board one, I asked, could clue, anagram for cull, be Janus, a program gone a wall? A wall. Now, cull, as you know, means to reduce the population by selective slaughter. Could this be their agenda? And we talk about depopulation a lot, don't we, in society? Now, could he be controlling the internet through CERN? That could be their portal, like in the film. Now, on April the 30th, 1993, CERN put the World Wide Web software in the public domain. This word it gets, wow. Let's look at that date. Instead of the 30th, obviously just three. So three, add four, add one, add nine, add nine, add three equals 29. Two add nine equals, you got it, 11. <laughs> it's just wow. Now in Tron, they have a laser that takes him to the other realm. It's called Shiva. And as you know, and as I showed in the other video, there is a Shiva at CERN. But I asked a question in Gematra, is Clue, Janos, it gives me 1, 2, 5, 3, which equates to 11. As you know, CERN is Cernanus, the Horned God, and Cernanus is Janos. In Gematra, I asked, I typed in CERN, it gives me 1, 2, 8, is 11, the doorway, the portal, which we all can agree. Here's the Shiva, like Tron, CERN have one. But look at the arm position. And I've talked about this in many a video. It's the 10 10 position, or as you can say, the 10 2 position. But in time wise, you know, 10 2 is 10 past 10. But let's add that just to let the numbers. 1 add 1 equals, you got it, 11. Now, advertisements show it all the time. They say it's for victory, they say it's um, for, for a smiley face, all that rubbish. But it's not, it's a ritual to Janos because it adds to, as you can see in Gematria, 11. Now, <laughs> do you remember the Gotthard Tunnel opening ceremony where they had a Cernanus, the Horned God, as we know is Janos? They also had a clock there and it kept stopping. Yep, yeah, you got it, at the 10 to, or 10 past 10, which adds to 11. Guys, it, it just blew me away when you put the, all this together. Now let's have a look quickly at the tunnel. The tunnel was basically opened on the 11th of December 2016. Not just the 11 in your face, but add all the dates. It gives you 11. Wow. Now years before, they had another little ritual. 128 people missing, 11 confirmed dead. But even the 128 adds to, you got it, 11. Now look when it was published, the 26, add 2 and the 1, equate to, you got it, 11. Right guys, now I'm going to talk about the Vatican in the 11s, but to get the flavour right for anyone who's just watching it for the first time, basically Janos, number 11, Janos was basically the first Pope. He was the first key bearer, as you can see from books. You can go and research it yourself. You'll find this the same as what I've found. He's also known as Noah. That's how significant Yanis is and why I do the research I do to show people the significance of basically Yanis and Noah. So as we know, the Lateran Treaty was an agreement signed by the Vatican and then King of Italy, King Victor Emmanuel III. More 11s, just a coincidence. The treaty recognised the Vatican City as an independent state under the sovereignty of the Holy See. Mussolini, the king's representative, signed on, you guessed it, 
the 11th. The date was the 11th of February, 1929. The Pope was Pius XI. Yeah, you got that. 11th was the king. Really, it signed on the 11th and the Pope was the 11th. And in Gematria, the letter and treaty adds to, you guessed it, 11. So that's a bit of a wow for me, showing you just all the connections so far between Janos and the number 11. Most of you will already see it in a few, a few of the videos, so I had to compile them into one, just so people can actually see the significance of it. So the Second Ecumenical Council of the Vatican, commonly known as the Second Vatican Council, or Vatican II, the two looks like an 11 basically. It was set up to complete unfinished tasks of the first council, and basically to outreach and address any of the modern needs. Its opening was in Rome on the 11th of October 1962. Again, another 11. And because in Gematria you can't put numbers in, you have to write them down as letters. I put in Vatican II, it adds to 128, and you guess it, adds to 11. So this is showing you the significance of 11 and Yanis on this realm. And this is why I wanted to put this video together to show you guys. Here we have the two keys, synonymous with the Vatican and the Holy See. One the spiritual power, one the worldly power, held together by the cord. I believe that cord is the vocal cords, the voice of God, holding the two frequency keys, silver and gold. As you've seen before, silver and gold in the periodic table AUAG. In Gematra, those two equate to 11, Janice's number. Cannot be a coincidence that, as you can see, 209 equals 11. Now, when you picture two keys together, what do you see? I'll put it on the screen now. For me, they represent the number 11. Each key representing number one. And if we move it along, I've put two number ones together to represent the two keys. For me, they're identical, obviously it's just my opinion, but also if we remember from an old video, 11, as you can see in the screen, will make another famous symbol linked to the church. Yep. You got it across. Is there any coincidence? Who knows? I'll leave that up for you, good, great guys. TV and films. Now I'm not going to do everything with 11 it, just you'll see. Television 1028 equals 11. Films 155 equals you got it 11. Now because I've done on this before, Harry Potter has 11 letters. And you might be thinking, why is he talking about Harry Potter in this 11? You'll see, guys. Harry Potter in Gematria, 164 equates to 11. Now, one of the main characters, Hagrid, is the keeper of keys and the grounds, etc. Basically, he's a janitor, Yanis's name. Hagrid. In Gematria, 4 out 7, you got it, 11. Now, one of the characters in the first film, basically, is Janus. It was Voldemort in Quirinus Criddle's head. And as you can see, you can actually see Quirinus actually derives from the word Janus. So, J.K. Rowling wrote the books with Janus in mind. And the number 11. You might think, is that it, Paul? Nope. <laughs> the author J.K. Rowling's first name is Joan. That's a derivative of Janos. J.K. Rowling in Gematria, 119 equals, you got it, 11. Now, one of the biggest scenes in the first film when Harry Potter gets his letter from Hogwarts, it's his birthday. Guess how old he is? Yep. You got it, guys. He was 11. 11. How crazy is that? And I just had to mention another TV series, Stranger Things, because obviously people have been telling me, I've not watched it yet, the main character is called Eleven. And it's about telekinesis and that, and it's based, I believe, on the Montauk uh, Project. Well, guess what? The Montauk Project, 1442, equates to Eleven. <laughs> when is it not a coincidence guys I love to say that lately but you can see 11 
And it's no surprise that the union for the TV and films that I've included in this, the Screen Actors Guild, have a look at the logo. It is Janos. No coincidence, and as you can see, in your face. The rabbit hole, I've been telling you for ages that it's Janos. It's a transition, it's a gateway, it's a portal. Let's ignore the fact that a rabbit's head represents the 11, its ears. But there's so, so much more. It can trap, it can free. All depends on the intent of the person who is going down that hole. But we have a, a ritual and if you say white rabbit three times on the first day of every month remember janice gets every first day of every month it's a sign of good luck let's ignore the fact that in gematra the rabbit hole is 11. it's just crazy isn't it how when we look at something we see it with fresh eyes let's talk about the matrix remember what was said to neo the one follow the white rabbit hmm then we have another transition of life. Stay where you are or take the red pill. Hmm. Transitions again. AI again. The Matrix again. Everything is connected to Janos. The red pill, blue pill. 11 again. You just can't make this up. So Logos is tied to the word. Right? And remember John 1-1 one, one, which blew me away. It was both Yanis and his number 11. In the beginning was the word. That, as we know, is Logos. And the word was with God. And the word was God. So whatever the word is, is God. Now what I found is not only just shock me to my roots. I'm just like, no way. I can't believe it. So as you know, I like working with words. So I looked for that anagram of word and the best one i could get was d-o-r-w because it really sounds like door like door like a little accent and people always talk about idrisil as the tree well guys this will blow you away the proto-indo-european word for oak is d-o-r-w door and that became the word for a door so the oak is a doorway between worlds as it lives between the worlds. Tell me that isn't wow. And as I've shown you in previous videos, Yanis is also known as the Oak. That old clip that you just saw was from a, a video about three weeks ago called the Doorway Effect. And as you can see, Janice is the doorway. He is number 11. You can quite see it on the screen above. Also the Doorway Effect it adds to 11. Now that is a phenomenon that when you walk through a door, you forget what you were originally going to go out of the door to do. A lot of people talked about how, yes, we have this effect. So I made a video on it and that's just what I found about the oak tree being the word of God and also the old word for door. Now, in this video, I've used a lot of gematria. But guess what? <laughs> yeah, you got it. Gematria. In gematria comes to 74 which is 11. So thus endeth the video of the Janus Rituals part 2. Hopefully you guys you've enjoyed and seen the significance of 11 in regards to Janus and in this realm. So guys stay safe, always wear a smile and pay it forward. Bye guys. <laughs>